Hello everybody, this is Argon Matrix, we're looking at episode 69, oh yeah, okay, that's enough, of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, and in the last episode, I left you wondering as to what this switch does, and now I'm going to show you. It does that, it raises the water level, and when you do that, it actually raises a hookshot target right there, because apparently stone gets raised by water, like that, I don't know, actually it probably does, but whatever. Anyway, so, as you see, there's a switch on the other side, like one of those daisy switches, along with a sculptula. And basically, all you have to do, I think, is, well, if you have the big orange sword, you can just slice it like that. But if you don't have it, then you can just do a spin attack, and you'll hit it. Anyways, there's the sculptula. There's the sculptula. Can I kill it? Alright, fine, I'll use the hookshot. Nice. And get our 74th token. Awesome. Sweet. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and go back. Yep, see, this place was entirely optional. It's only for a sculpture, because we're never gonna return here again. I can promise you that much. What I can't promise you, however, is that we're not gonna return to the Fire Temple again. Oh my god, that was... That, that was just ridiculous. Oh my god. I'm never gonna live that down. Whatever. Okay. Yep, are you getting tired of the me equipping and unequipping the iron boots yet? Because trust me, there's still a lot more of that to come. Alright, so we are done with that now. Um, let's go to the bottom left side now. And there is a block here that we can push. Yeah, I'm assuming that we push it. Yep. Push it, Link! Push it! Push it! Work it, honey! Work it! Oh my god! Oh my god, push! Push, Link! You're so strong, you're so mighty! Yes! Yes, you can do it, Link. You can do it. Oh my god, it fell. I have to go back down there now. Wee, Boom. Alright. What's down here, anyways? There is... Um, nothing there. What's there? Um, nothing there. I guess I just have to float up. I was hoping I could go a little faster and hook shot up, but no dice. Alright, in this room there is something. I don't know. Oh, uh, there's a daisy switch. Awesome. And what did that do? Oh, it created a water pillar for us to get on. Sweet. Oh my god. No. You stu stupid, stupid water. Stupid tactite. Oh my god. I failed that. That was epic fail. And how do I get back up? Look shot. Please. Yay. Yeah, they're not that cruel. They won't just trap you down here and assume that you know your own way out. Which I would. I could just play a warp song, but that would be ever so not fun. Ever so not fun. Hmm. And there we go. We just walk on water somehow. The upward thrust equally matches our weight. Which means that we can walk on water, and here's a whirlpool we're in. Sweet. Okay, basically you want to go over to this side of the room, kind of, and put on your iron boots right over here, so that you land on this thing. That's basically how you want to do that. And then, you take out your hook shot. there's a daisy switch over there. So we're going to hit that. And that will cause that gate over there to open. And then, you can just take out your hookshot again, and hookshot over here. And we, there are some things there, we're just gonna go ahead and float over them, hopefully. Oh, well, it looks like one of them got me, damn it. And over here, there's another small chest containing yet another small key. Yep. Isn't it lovely? Oh god, I have to hit the daisy switch again, what am I doing? What are you doing, dude? What are you doing? Freaking monkey. Alright. And, oh my god, that thing looks scary, it was, alright, okay, di dive down, dive down, you can make it, Link, come on, you're not an idiot here, well, maybe you are, I don't know, maybe you are mentally retarded, okay, so that's all that we have on this side of, or in this room, I guess, in this branch of the water temple, I guess you'd say, uh, you could even make a checklist of all the different branches in the water temple, because there's, like, a bunch, there's pretty much, I don't know. It's kind of hard. It's not too hard to explain. It's basically just one branch going off in each direction. Except, like, on the top floor, there's no branch going off to the... 
No, the second floor. There's no branch going up to the top. That's why. All right. Yep. Okay. Five minutes, nine seconds. I'm not doing too bad. About halfway through the second video of the water temple, I got two keys already. Nice. Um, am I trapped here? Yeah, I, I am. I have to use the hook shot. Damn it. Tricked me. Okay. Let's see here. Hook shot, hook shot, hook shot. Nice. Hmm, I think sometimes you can hook shot to those targets from like a right the right angle and you'll actually like fall, you won't grab onto the ledge or anything. Okay, so we're gonna pretty much omit that first the the path going to the top up there on the bottom floor here. Because that leads to the boss key, I'm pretty sure, and we don't have the resources to get there yet. So yeah. Uh in this room looks like we have to use the hook shot somehow. Somewhere. There we go. Nice. Oh, oh my god, yeah, see? That's exactly what I meant. If you hookshot it from the wrong angle or something, then that happens. Okay, there we go. And here's the second place in the temple where you can change the water level, so let's just change the water level. Yep. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Nice. Okay. So before you actually progress, like, towards the door or anything here, you're actually going to want to dive- No, don't get up on this there, you stupid. You're going to want to dive down, so you go below this block, and when you're below this block, you can put on your iron boots, and you will sink, and you will go into a secret hole. And you actually do have to go down here. It's not for, like, a sculpture or anything. It's actually for a key, so you do have to go down here at some point. And this is the key that a lot of people tend to miss, especially on their like first run through of this. All right, um, got it. Actually, let's go back because I know the enemies are gonna fall right on my head if I hook shot that from there. So let's hit the daisy switch here. Nice. And a bunch of enemies are gonna fall, of course. Let's see. Can I get them all from here? That would be awesome. No, I don't want to hurt you. Uh, go away. Okay, can I just kill you, please? There we go. Now that you're dead, I can actually handle it. Oh, there's another one of them. Oh, I didn't even notice that second clam there. Spiky butt clam of death. And one more enemy. And it's spiky. Oh my god. It's a spinia. Spiky spinia of doom. And that causes another gate that's over here to open. We equip our Kokiri boots, and we rise! Rise, Link, rise! Yay. Are we in heaven now? No, we're just at a place with another small key. Lovely. Because everyone loves the small keys in the water temple, don't they? That's like the best part, you know? Alright. Um, let's just keep on trucking here. Go back over here to where we were in the first place, the center room. This big pit in the middle of this big pillar in the center. Hi, Link. Hi. I see you. Hi. Okay. That's enough of that. Okay, so let's go ahead and get up on here, I guess. And I just want to see, can I hook shot up to anywhere here? No, I can just hook shot to right there, which will take me to this door. Nice. And, oh, it locks behind me, dude. That's not fair. Okay, what's over here? Let's check it out. Hmm. Oh, and I just remember something I have to do. I I need... I'm glad I remember that when I did just now. That That's very helpful. Oh, yeah, this path leads to the compass, I'm pretty sure. If I'm right. Let's see. Am I going to be right? I don't know. Okay, so you basically want to stand right next to this chest, and you're going to need your bow and arrows to hit that, looks like. Uh, I like using my hookshot, not my bow and arrows. That way I don't consume anything. So you want to hit that, and it's going to cause a very short timer where that thing will go away. And you have to quickly, like, I mean very, very quickly run over it and open this chest. 
And this chest will contain, just like I said, the compass! Awesome! So now we have the map and the compass. Nice. Let's see. Anything? Mm, just some hearts. Some very well appreciated hearts, because I was running a little low on- Ow! Get off the spikes, dude. I was running a little bit lower on life than I would have liked. Okay. Yeah, so that thing that I remembered to do is that you actually have to, um... Once you get the water to, like, this middle level here, you want to go back down to to here. To, like, the the right entrance or the right branch of the lower level. 